Hello guys, this is Jose from City of Cars. Today we're gonna to be doing a walk around video yet again. This time on a 2021 Chevrolet Corvette. Now this is a Stingray 1LT with the Z51 package, which if you don't already know, that is something that you must have if you're buying a CA Corvette. Uh, it's about a $6,000 option that's gonna upgrade the cooling system, brakes, uh, definitely a really, really good bang for your buck factor. Um, this car particularly has got about uh, 5,000 miles or so, so basically a brand new used car. Um, now, if you notice here in the back, it is gonna be a convertible edition, which makes it really, really cool, especially because you get an extra button on the key fob. Um, so if we unlock this and hit this button here, the car's gonna do something really cool. It's gonna drop the top automatically for us. You can take a peek there. That is really, really cool to see. Uh, this car's priced about $75.5. So again, for a car to do that at $75.5 and have a mid-engine V8, absolutely great bang for your buck factor. Uh, you also get the torch red seat belts, uh, the painted red calipers, and clearly you can see the Z51 package right on there. Um, we can pop the trunk and the frunk, which is definitely cool. So if you could take a peek here, even though it's a convertible, you do still have some storage space that you can utilize. And that's not the only thing because you do get one in the back as well. And that is a soft closing trunk, which is really cool. And moving up to the front of the vehicle. Um, and if you didn't already know, there is a button located right below here that you can actually press. And that's gonna open up your front on the vehicle as well. So you do have two ways of opening it up. Um, just gotta find it there. But anyways, taking a peek at the front. Looks like a uh, previous owner was very, very uh, careful about his cars, considering we got a couple deta uh, detail rags here. Got a little button just in case somebody climbs in there. You got another uh, 12 volt, and it's actually a pretty deep trunk, so definitely nice. Uh, let's go ahead and shut this back. And let's climb and take a peek inside the interior. So opening up the door, you're going to be greeted by that Stingray logo on the kick plate. Um, got the unlock and unlock. You do have your options to open up your frunk and your trunk right there. Obviously your convertible window controls. That's going to be for the back window right here. So this does go up and down as well. Uh, but let's go ahead and sit inside the car and fire it up here. Definitely a great exhaust. Uh, let's go ahead and turn down the volume here a second. And we'll go ahead and that's right here. Uh, taking a peek, obviously you got heated seats, ventilated seats. So that's a really nice little feature, definitely an upgrade. Got this nice little Z button that will give you your uh, customized uh, settings for steering feel, engine, and your brake feel. So you can customize that to be as gentle or as aggressive as you may like. And you also have some preset modes in here. So if we go through them, you have my mode, touring mode, so you can kind of go through a few different options as far as what you want the car to feel like and perform like including track mode obviously it's going to be one of the most aggressive settings um, and the other cool thing is it actually changes the cluster around too um, you also do have a heads up display on this car um, OnStar obviously equipped you got your garage door buttons you do have a wireless charger uh, speaker back here with a Stingray M uh, engraved into it uh, you, we do have a glove box that does have the owner's manuals right on there. Uh, Bose performance a sound system. So the heated steering wheel. So as far as luxury features, this car definitely is pretty well equipped. Um, yeah, let's take a peek at the glove box here. They do give you a Type C, a USB, and an auxiliary cord, which is definitely nice. Um, gotta love the flat edge on the steering wheel. Definitely makes it a little bit more comfortable. It makes it so you're not really hitting your knees as much. Um, the other nice thing about this mirror is you can actually make it, it is powered, you can dim it, and I want to say that you can actually make it an LCD screen here. Do you see the right button for that? No. There we go. And now you can make it into a camera. Alright, so I was right. I guess the top just has to be up. So if you turn it right there, you can actually see that this actually does turn into a digital camera. Um, so you can actually zoom in and out, um, which makes it really cool. Or you can level it so you can actually see 
like your wing, which is definitely convenient. So this can be a secondary camera, which is very convenient, especially when you have the top uh, up. Uh, very comfortable car seating position, cannot complain, but let's go ahead and take this on a quick little drive. If you pull up on this, that's gonna give you us reverse. And obviously you have a nice backup camera uh, that's very easy to see, definitely convenient. And we're gonna go ahead and back this up here. And then to put it in drive, all you do is flick up. Now to put it in neutral, you just press the neutral button, reverses another flip up, and you do have manual mode that allows you to access these really nice paddle shifters. And they're definitely decently sized, definitely very convenient. Um, definitely makes it a little bit more fun to drive if you're having a little bit spirited drive. Um, let's go ahead and take this down the hill. So let's go ahead and I'll skip this part and I'll get back to you guys once we're on the road. All right guys, now that we took it off the hill, as you can see, we're gonna go ahead and just kind of give it a nice little drive around the block. Definitely a fun experience. I mean, driving these Corvettes really make you feel like you're in something special. A great bang for the buck. I'm really happy these finally started to actually experience depreciation. It was really sad when you started seeing these things 20,000 over sticker. I remember in the early times of COVID, nice to know that you can actually get these under MSRP. Again, this one's going for 75.5, which is well below the MSRP on this great great banging for the bug factor I mean, performance on these things is just absolutely insane for what you pay um definitely if you're looking for a corvette please check us out obviously this one's going to be available uh if you go on our website at www.cityofcars.com you'll be able to access the window sticker carfax you'll know that obviously this one's clean as a whistle with exactly 4,634 miles um i'm gonna go ahead and pull back in here We'll pull it up to the front door and we'll do one last walk around the vehicle. And obviously, if you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Obviously, happy to answer any questions about this vehicle and availability. You can also reach me directly at my personal cell, which is 248-892-9663. Uh, but let's go ahead and put this in park. Another nice little feature is you do have this button right here. Let's say you're coming up too close to an edge and you're not quite confident if you're gonna hit or not. You can see right here, it literally tells you exactly where the curb is. So we can go ahead and park it right there. Definitely a very convenient car, uh, or a convenient feature, I should say, when you're parking a low car such as this. You don't wanna scrape up that front splitter. Um, let's go ahead and step out of the vehicle. And we'll do one last little walk around here. Definitely a beautiful car. Again, no scuffs on any of the rims. Everything's nice and clean, no dents, no scratches. Take a peek at that exhaust. Beautiful sound. Definitely a really cool car. Um, again, you got a second, hit that subscribe bell. That definitely does help us out. But other than that, you guys have a wonderful rest of the day and hopefully you'll uh, check us out.